that early. I wanted to finish editing my video, but alas, it's still not up because I had a lot of things to do this morning. Back to work we go. It's 3 p.m. and my video is up! I just posted my room tour. Let's go. Oh my gosh, that took so long. Mostly because it took a while for me to get all the links and also I got like a little distracted along the way. So for example, I was chatting with my roommate for a bit and also had to like eat and sustain myself. I guess that's not really me being distracted. I just like couldn't not do it. And I had a meeting. But right now it's like 3.10ish. I'm going to meet someone from Colombia. We're going to the Hungarian pastry shop. I think that's what it's called. I met them through this club that I joined. Honestly, really hungry because all I had to do was cake. I didn't even vlog or document that because I just, I was so hungry. So I just ate it. And then I had coffee and coffee for some reason makes me hungrier. So it doesn't really help my hunger. I know some people say like coffee makes them fuller, but it makes me hungrier. So now I am like jittery and hungry and I don't know if I should go eat because we are eating like pastries, I assume. Here, like my pipe. So this pipe right here, it causes so much noise. It's super, it's quite loud, but like it's fine. I'll heat up some rice and then I'll have some kimchi and seaweed and I'll call it a morning. I think I'm gonna do that. I'm so hungry. in two weeks as opposed to like all of those classes in the past year and a half it was just completely remote so it feels much much more different 
Hey, I wanted to wash my sheets, so I think I'm gonna do that first. I just finished submitting my brand concepts for some sponsored posts that I'm doing in the future. I also made some tea that my dad recommended to support my digestive system. Oh, I had like a pretty good, like kind of slow morning. Right now, I have about 40 minutes until my class starts. And ideally, I would really like to take some photos. Like I want to take some Instagram photos because I haven't taken or shared any Instagram photos in quite some time. And I also also need to make breakfast. Those are my top priorities and I'm gonna do that right now. I think I might just toast some bagels. That's really easy. <sighs> Let's make breakfast! is starting in five minutes but I took some photos oh my gosh first class of the day oh my god I shouldn't talk and eat I kind of sounded like my um, pipe in the corner, you know? Yeah. Um, I finished my class. I had light dinner. I don't really want to say dinner because I'm still hungry and I'm also planning on eating later. Yeah. Okay, I took two classes today. It was pretty it was pretty standard in that like all we did was cover the syllabus, but I don't know, I just feel like very stressed. <laughs> I feel very stressed. Even though for the most part like things should be going fine, but I don't know why I just feel like a lot. So um I'm gonna light this candle. I'm gonna take some vitamins that are supposed to reduce stress. I'm gonna make my bed and then sit in bed and like watch something and maybe read because I, I just need to like i'm gonna be fine i'm gonna be fine i'm gonna be fine i'm i will be fine there's, there's really nothing wrong i, I don't know why yeah Okay, 
I'm just gonna eat it straight in this bowl. I just spent the past like hour or so having another existential crisis because I wasn't sure what I wanted to major in. What else is new? I've changed my major at least like eight times the past year and a half or like since I started school. When I originally applied and got into Columbia, I wanted to major in economics and philosophy, mostly because I really like philosophy and I wanted to like econ because I thought it was interesting, but then I took an econ class last semester and I realized I didn't like it. So then I was like, maybe I should study film and media because I really do like video form content, like YouTube, like I really genuinely enjoy doing YouTube. So I was like, okay, maybe film and media make sense, even though I don't really want to be a director or producer or actor or like anything of that kind. Took my intro to film and media class yesterday and I was kind of intimidated by it and then I was reconsidering my major. So I looked through basically every single major we have and I was like, what should I do? It's rough out here. A lot of imposter syndrome going on, but I have another class in two minutes. I like did not realize how busy this semester would be until it's like actually happening because I, I thought I did a pretty good job with like organizing my schedule but it is quite a bit of stuff and I, I don't know if I wanted mm, I'm just going through it this this is I'm pretty excited for um I'm taking intro to Korean pending because I'm waitlisted and also I have to choose a language don't really want to learn Chinese so I'm picking Korean I also considered French because those are the three languages that I'm working on I finished my last class of the day. Technically speaking, I took more classes today, but because I finished earlier, I feel much calmer. I kind of want to take a nap. I think I'm gonna read and also take a nap. Let me double check what I have left on my to do list. I purchased this earlier. Also, I like how big the words are. before I finish eating it but um yeah I'm almost done now so literally I'm just sitting at my desk at all hours or on my bed and then 
once in a blue moon I do leave my apartment. I think I finally figured out how to style my bangs. This one's still like confused, but um, this side's much better. And I'm using, oh yeah, this one's, I don't know, I like, I do the same technique, but like, I guess the way my hair grows, it just doesn't work. My neck was kind of hurting. I think I slept improperly, but I'm gonna try to do some yoga. side of cherry tomatoes it's a random combo and it doesn't really make sense but it's fine oh my gosh long ass class and my back still hurts and it's really really bothering me I finished like 75% of North by Northwest. It's pretty interesting. Like it was always a movie that was on my to watch list, but I just never had the chance to watch it. And so it's really cool that I get to watch movies for class now. Yeah, I'm excited to finish it. We're gonna finish it for our next class. And also she gave us some assigned readings and I feel like a nerd or anything, but I'm actually very excited to do the readings because I feel like it'll be really interesting. Yeah, now I'm excited for school and I feel a lot better about what I'm going to major in and everything is gonna be fine. I just need to trust in the process, but for now right now i'm going to roll because my back hurts so much and i also want to go downstairs and get my packages so let's do that So sad. Um, I thought my class started at five. It started at four ten, and so I checked at like four forty-five or something, and then I realized it started. So I went to class half an hour late. But um, you know it's okay. I just finished, and my rice also just finished cooking, so it's all fine. I'm gonna go eat a little bit. I had my bagel this morning, but I'm still kind of hungry. I'm excited for my broccoli that I made yesterday and my tofu that I also made yesterday and also hopefully this rice will be fluffier than the last time I made it. I'm gonna call my mom and then prepare my meal and then after I'm gonna clean my room and then chillax because I'm not done with the final class of the day. I mean of the week. I have one more class tomorrow. Good. I literally scheduled myself so I have classes every single day. It's fine.
Hi, mother. Nana. Oh my gosh, I started eating again before I remembered to record. But um, here is my rice with broccoli and some tofu. The rice is really soft this time around, so I'm pretty happy. I ended up journaling. I forgot to vlog, but look, I journaled in my hobonichi. Um, I finally filled in the pages that I did get to um, put in photos and the stuff that I wanted to decorate. Um, I'm really happy with it. It looks so cute. I wanted to add more stickers, but I'm also kind of lazy. I was doing it on the floor, so it was a little hard because my back hurt. What time is my class tomorrow? How long is it? I feel like it's quite a long class too. 10 to 2. Why is this class so long? I also haven't been getting any emails from this professor, so I have no idea what's going on. But anyway, I'm going to do the rest of my readings and then just go to sleep. the last class of this week I finished a little bit earlier than I expected which makes me very excited and happy it went pretty well I was having a lot of doubt and imposter syndrome about whether or not I wanted to take cinema or like whether or not I wanted to major in film but now I feel pretty good about myself I'm just really excited for school now I, I wasn't really as attentive as I could have been and instead I downloaded another notebook for, uh, for my good notes on Etsy and I'm gonna use this as an excuse to get excited for school which I think is a pretty valid excuse. We finished like around an hour early which is really nice but then we also have to like do a lot of screenings so and reading. I'm gonna try to do some of that. Also change, also pick up my ID. And then I'm going to hang out with one of my friends, Monica, later today. so smeared. Can you hear my pipe? Here we go. 